Good morning on one and all. This is a beautiful Saturday morning. First Saturday in the month of July. And I'm just here to look on the progress of what we have done over the past two weeks. So we planted some, as you know, we planted some pop chow, some kalalo, we did cabbage and we did corn and we also did some cucumber so we're gonna look at the progress so as you can see oh and the chocho so let me start out with the chocho one there you can see the the pop chow you can select the the final look a little bit a little bigger now we have the other the other one over there other one like the chocho like this let's come to the second row you can finally see the color the color low them they are a bit fine but they are finally coming up they are finally coming up you can see oh, the bamboo the bamboo leaf fall down and then the cabbage purple cabbage you can see most of the purple cabbage there you see down the line and then you see the infamous corn so what I did uh, I plant the corn and the the cucumber together in this at the same root so I'm assuming the cucumber is gonna run on some of the corn trees you can see them so these were the first one that was planted two weeks ago and if you look down now this is the second batch was planted this week so what I did I did them almost two weeks apart so I don't have everything coming at at the same time so I'm gonna try and zoom in I don't know if you can see there's a little patch at the pop chow because the pop chow come came up before everything else so that is what I'm looking at so the course of the next six weeks I can look to get pop chow and kalalo and then cabbage is gonna take longer the corn I know corn is for the summer but I plant them a bit later just trying to see how they're gonna manage the weather I you know they said that we're getting a little some some hurricane coming Sunday or you know Jamaica bless so we probably don't see, see that but I just come see how they fear before we get the the heavy the heavy water so you can see they're looking they're looking lovely corns are looking lovely the the purple cabbage they're not too bad they're coming up here and there here and there and Mr. Fine Fine Kalalu himself, they are here on the finer side, but you can see them, see them popping out, and the pop chow, pop chow running away, leave everybody. So, as I said already, to give God thanks for small mercies, but. This is big blessings. One pack of seed cost me $120. I bought, bought them in Constant Spring. $120 a pack of seed. So I'm looking at what? Cabbage, pop chow, the color low, the corn, and the cucumber. Five pack of seed at a $120. You can do the math. So less than a thousand dollars. And with time. And with the blessings of Almighty God, it can reap over twenty thousand dollars worth of product within within the space of six months. So thousand dollars converted to twenty thousand dollars in six months or less. You know, cucumber is going hard, pop chow, you can sell even a bag for hundred or fifty dollars or seventy dollars, wherever you want to sell it, you know, colour low. A lot of person into green juice now, so 
you can do your color lobe mixed with your your ginger or your lip add a little lemon to it so you know corn in the next six months or less i will have corn and you know the cucumber soon start running i'm gonna get some of the bamboo sticks over there those fine bamboo sticks so put it at the root so it can it can run on it just like how you have the yam you have the yam running on on the other trees so like if you look over there you see the coconut tree and you see the yam running on it so stuff like that i want to do and uh waiting to get a a help from one of my virgin big big virgin i'm gonna give me some pineapple but and a pineapple sucker so when i get the driver just go for the pineapple sucker them and the last thing i'm gonna do is the banana so i can hold the land because you can see the land is very steep the land is very steep see very steep so i want when the the water come I can have more thing to put on it to, to hold up the land so God forbid one day a slide I don't roll go too far I can't manage to hold on to something so what I'm gonna do I'm gonna build some more like I build this step use the bamboo and then I fill up the dirt over it I'm gonna use this this log put it down there and then just dig out the dirt and, and add the the leaf the bamboo leaf and then I just plant things on it to hold, hold the land somewhat same thing I did here you can step on it too hard because at the bottom of it is just leaf and then I put the dirt over it to hold it and then I plant plant on it so I'm learning each day each day I go I'm learning something new first when I started the first time I said boy you can't put the seed in other land because ants I got to eat it up, but I guess that was true, but to God be the glory, great things he has done. As you can see, most of the seeds them that I plant, they hold up. They hold up. Current seed hold up. Okay. Uh, in each row, I put three current trees in each in each hole. See, looking at about one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, nine, ten. So 10 10 10 all had three seeds that you're looking at 30 corn tree. So if I even get one corn off of each of the uh, each of the the tree them, you're looking at 30 corns. If I get two or two, I will be like 60. So that will be a first time for me. I planted corn before. Never get I only get a, one single one that I use to see them to do replanting and the white fly. The white fly did my body. But just like in life, you have your ups and your downs. You're going to have a lot of struggles with things that you're taking on for the first time. But you just have to be patient. Patient is the biggest key in, in everything. You have to be keep patient. You have to trust God and have your faith in Him. Because it's not every time you're going to put something, you're going to be successful. You're going to have times when you're going to fall off. But just keep trusting God. You will help you to pull through all the time. So that is the update on the farm. This video is gonna be one of the last of the series for now because I'm gonna get about the next two to three weeks to see where what the turnaround is because you know we're having a lot of rain coming in. So I'm gonna just make it stay here for the next two to three weeks and then I come back home and check and just see how it work out. But People, you, you can't be down and out too far to restart. I was down and out. I had a, a little garden before where I was living before. And I had to leave it when I was moving. And I come and I do a restart. And place of two weeks, I'm looking pretty good. So, just like life, pick up yourself. Trust God. Pray. Ask Him for what you want. And just start somewhere. Once you start, God will do the rest. Alright, so have a blessed day. And remember, give God thanks. God is good all the time. Now when you're up alone, or when you're down alone, give God thanks all the time. Because He's indeed a blessing. 
he is a blessing. He's a father, he's a lover, he's a brother, he's a sister. He's a confidant. Anything that you're going through, not tell Tom, Dick and Harry. Just tell it to Jesus and he, he will fix it for you. Alright? Have a blessed day. Uh, people, subscribe. I want to use this medium also to big up some big up some small company. I want to big up my uncle company, McLean, McLean Stalerin. One of them will really encourage me and help me out when I was down. And big up Nails by Sian. You don't know, go and support her in the summer. You want your nails to look good, you want your body massage, you have a little aches or pain, you can go and do your full body massage. Ladies that are going out to the beach now that the beach, are, beach is open, you can go and do your Brazilian, whatever that's supposed to be. I just know the name, you know, something to do with shaving your coach or something like that. But just go and support, right? And big up my sister business, Dana McLean, Leonie, she have a a business where she print cups, she, she, she print anything you want, anything. From a, from a pin to an anchor, she can print it on a shirt for you. She can do business card, stuff like that. She's on Instagram, think, think, you know, Leonie or something like that. So go and check out the small business. Build a, build a small business today. Alright? And have a great day.